Hey guys, it's Tick here, coming at you with my minty fresh gaming skills and knowledge, and today we are going to be playing Alien Isolation. And I say we because... Hey guys, it's Toe here, and yeah, I'm joining uh, Tick over there in a game of Alien Isolation because, uh, yeah, he's, he's scared. Yeah, he's I'm scared. Got a problem with it? Uh, I want to make sure my settings are good. Well, it was a bit harder to convince you to play this, even though you wanted to do a Let's Play on it. Uh, I do, but also, it's spooky. Leave me alone. Yeah, but it's always going to be spooky. It's just kind of getting over that. What, man? Uh, Cowardice does not befit you. I don't care. <laughs> I noticed. Alright, so I think I'm going to play on medium. That's reasonable. But, yeah. Override it. We were gonna record and then shit happened. <laughs> shit hits sometimes, it's fine. So that's why I had an existing save, not because I've played the game before, like every other game. <laughs> but you have. I have played it before on your computer, but I only played for like 30 minutes to an hour or some shit like that. Yeah, and then you never and touched because it. Because I'm scared, I, I don't play it like. I literally Very quickly. bought that game specifically because you wanted to play it. Look, I told you, you I was going to get it on my PS4. Yeah, but... And then you bought it, and I, you're like, it, okay. It was on sale for like four bucks, and oh, so okay. I bought it okay. because I'm like, Final oh, look, this is a chance. Final commercial starship it. Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew. Kane. Lambert. Parker. Brett, Ash, and Captain Dallas are dead. I've never even Cargo watched and any ship alien destroyed. Hmm? I've never even watched I should reach the frontier in I about have. six weeks. I have. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. So. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. How did everybody die? Uh, crash. <laughs> I wish it was that simple. I wish this was just a simple survival game where you go punch trees. <laughs> uh -huh. Unfortunately, it's not. <laughs> Why can't this be Minecraft? I think it could be far less entertaining than this case. Yeah, for sure. Hey, look, Ripley. Ripley, survivor. I'm Samuels. I work for the company. Okay. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. Looks like an engine. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a permanent freeport. I know facility. what it is. You don't got to be rude about it. I know. It. Trans it's arranged. To be nice. Right. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Okay. Look, Ripley, when this job came across my desk, I read the case history. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. When you say it like that, it's kind of obvious, isn't it? You're still right. looking, aren't you? Well, obviously. It's like I've been clear to offer you a hero. place on the torrents Can if you want to come along. clearly on. chose Hosu for a reason. What are you Maybe going on about? Nothing. Freaking an anime that you haven't watched because you. you're a coward. Uh, right. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, I'm assuming they worked out their differences. Because if they didn't, she probably wouldn't have gone on this adventure. Well, even if they didn't, she might have, because she's looking for her is this mother. Is this cryo? Uh, maybe. 
looks like it. And then as you're getting out, that hinge breaks and the glass just bashes you on the head. What? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> uh, I just thought it would be funny. Oh, I, okay, so it doesn't <laughs> actually happen. No, but it would be funny. <laughs> That's debatable. It would be funny and you know it. She sleeps with her ID card. Well, I'm sure you're supposed to. Little tube. That doesn't look like it'd be the most comfortable place to sleep. Well, you're in cryo, it's fine. Ah, so it is cryo. Probably. I said that. Get dressed. Right. Find your clothes. You're basically walking around the, the ship naked. Well, almost naked. Just... Oh, that's a save. It is a save, yes. Hey, look. There's Connor on there. Not I'm better more. than Ri I'm better than Ripley. <laughs> You're probably just like hiring. Makes sense. Not you, Pug. <laughs> Connors or whatever. Yeah, I, I got the joke. Two. Odd number two. All right, I'm just gonna leave that up. Let me search stuff. Just take random stuff from the lockers. Yeah, man. Yeah, re reasonable. It could help me save my ass. No, I know. I'm not. I'm not bad mouthing you. You know, for all this advanced technology, this doesn't look very advanced. Oh. It's like I'm not all reading out. this. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's fine, as long as you leave it up for a second for everybody else to read it. Yeah. Should they so wish. Right. I'm not reading that. I don't want to. I normally don't even... It's I, just I, like background input, and I don't want that. Yeah. It's like an elevator. It's like, it's really not important enough to remember. Uh, I'm sure it is, like, it adds story and stuff, but I don't want to, like, read most, it. Most things do, yeah. I don't want to read it, and that's the problem. I just don't want to read. Well, I'm not going to force you to read it. I know. Man, like, why are your clothes kept so far away? Uh, no, I'm dressed. I Wait, when'd you get dressed? Forever ago. What, what did you do? I stepped into a locker. <gasps> oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna I, check what's over here. I was wondering, that's the same way you just came yeah, from. Yeah, I know. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go, so... I don't I don't know if it's that way. That's shower. Uh, Congratulations. God, okay. what kind of psychopath showers with their clothes on? Uh, gee, I wonder what if, <laughs> I wonder who... Uh. The toilet's out of maintenance. <laughs> or it's, it's out of order, not maintenance. It needs maintenance. Yeah. Yeah, I was, I was thinking like monster shit. Literally, you have to walk across the sh uh, the ship in your underwear. It's like, now, eh. I'm sure the, the 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 male compatriots don't mind, but yeah, probably not. But I'm sure it's uncomfortable. Well, yeah. Taylor, good morning. That's how it tends Ripley to be. Said me not good, and I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Waylon Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. Now, the question I'm is, sorry. what kind of a ship was, was the Nostromo? Realize no your mother has been missing yeah. for 15 years, and, and you. Are, is it actually from the Alien okay. movie? Probably. We'll both get what we want, right? Because uh, um, if I'm thinking, it's either I think it was either that one big ship. He's probably I think it was that ride. big ship that I'll had a bunch of him. colonists on it. Like they were basically. Remember uh, from? No. Uh, <laughs> they ended up. It was the one that they introduced the uh, those really like uh, white fleshy necro uh, xenomorphs on. Remember? Oh. No. Like, <laughs> the, they they went down to the planet that they ran into the uh, into the the you know the the robots that they have that serve them and whatnot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so there was that one that was had that had been on there and was creating aliens, and it like tried to kill all of them mm -hmm. and whatnot. I I I've realized I actually just I I'm really sorry. I realized I just actually might have spoiled some things for people. I mean. Yeah, yeah, actually, I If you've did. seen it, you've seen it. 
Yeah, but, you know, <laughs> I, I, I probably should have said something about it. We'll just slap a big spoiler warning at the beginning of I don't of the think video. we're actually going to do that. We're not going to do that. Yeah. However, we will do that. We'll you say that we'll do me that. on it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no. Uh, basically, if I'm remembering right, it was a human colonization vessel. Was it in the first game? What? Are you talking about Dead Space? What? You said freaking... Oh, you said Xenomorph, not Necromorph. I'm having yeah. a stroke. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, you're kind of dumb. No. It's not that I'm dumb. I'm yeah. concentrating on finding stuff. We oh. don't want to steal. Ripley. Yeah, Samuel, sure. did you wake up early? No, um, well, it's uh, really it's an alien versus rest. predator kind of thing. It's I was just, just alien. Expecting the uh, it should be a uh, a colony vessel, if I'm right. I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M class, a later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Congrats. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. We talked. Okay, so She's nervous. Hmm. I hadn't noticed. The Nostromo She's a skilled was... executive, though. Should help us with any legal issues we might encounter. He said the Nostromo was like the Torin. The Torrens? I or so which is the ship we're on. Yeah. yeah. And so, like so it very well might be a col a colony esque ship. This wait, hold on, look around the medbay real quick. Uh I mean it's been a while since I've seen the movie. Uh, yeah, it definitely looks very similar. Uh, the Med Bay, I mean. Mm -hmm. But I'm sure I, I don't. Then, I don't think this is quite like kitted out to be a colony ship. I think right. it's just very similar. Well, and there's only like six sleepy spaces. Well, yeah. The rest of the time, uh, the rest of the people are supposed to be hanging up in cryopods. Like they're actually like a. Like strung up, basically. Like they're shoved into a pod. This is a smaller craft. And they're hung on rack, on like uh, racks. Mm. Well, th this is a smaller craft. Well, again, similar in spec. So it might it might be similar, but you know they're not exactly the same. Let's see, this one has like only a small people. portion of the crew actually needed the ability to like have easy access to cryo sleep. The rest of the people, like I said, were just put in pods. Right. And they they were hung on like shelves. But uh, what I'm saying currently is. This this ship is too small to house any more than like six people. Well, yeah, in living space, like I said, they'd have like a, a, a decent sized cargo hold, which I, you you might just not have access to, uh, and they're probably not using it for like you know transporting people, but they'd stick like a couple hundred people in there. Mm. Uh, they just line. They'd have like big shelves, and they just like line people up on it. It looks like a really shitty phone. <laughs> I mean. Like, you know, old, old it's, phone. No, I was thinking calculator. Uh, yeah, kind of like a calculator. Maybe that's what it is. Is it, a calculator? It very well could be a but very... But it looks like a, like a house phone. <laughs> it could very well be a bulky calculator house phone amalgamation. You bulky really do need to get out. You really, you really need to keep going, man. I don't know where I'm going. Like, I keep walking in circles. Come on, like... The, no, I keep literally walking in circles. Well, I just don't know where to go. Well, That's the problem. Stop doing that. Oh. Freaking foods. Not quite sure if you can eat any of the it. The food zone. Oh. There you go. Freaking Hope you all had a restful journey. No. The Torrens is in very good order for an old M-Class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. You said we're Squeeze. approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. You just have a build it. Routine. In and out. Connor, how are we doing? Uh -oh. I thought that was a, like, doom guy helmet for some reason. Prep con so I can say hello. Channel open, like Captain. Does everyone have their on briefing that. documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. You know. What? You know, on like a plane when you're crashing, these like bags drop down to breathe in. Yeah. That's what this is, I assume. Can I sit here? Wait, maybe. Can I yoink somebody's chair? Oh. Be there briefing. Yoink. Now, what is that? I think that was an outpost. Can we see it? That's the best of Switch to monitors. It's. Like Sevastopol the Station. big ship where that the whole game right takes place. Yeah. Is that damage? 
The switches Looks and dials like from the 1900s. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. <laughs> That's so weird. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sebastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Utani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. So the Nostromo was in. Hello, Marshal? Mar Marshal, this is the Torrens. Say again. Well, if that doesn't scream danger, I don't know what does. Right. Th their supposed Marshal just told you problems and whatnot. No, I think his name is Marshal. The station's oh. comms no, no. seem pretty screwed Colonel up. Marshall. So oh, our fitted yeah, sound will suit the Colonel radio. Marshall. Yeah, that's better. <laughs> yeah. You're literally wearing you know, like the equivalent the to body armor. For 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. It won't freaking help us Safe very trip. well. Why would you say that? Don't actually say anything uh, responsible. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover Those? police spacewalks. It's the only option. Cool. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. <laughs> and if I don't? What is that? Collateral damage. One of them is like literally an executive as well, which is yeah. kind of funny to think about. It's like, she works for um, Depressurize <laughs> Hating this. Right. Just shadow me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. The oh, that's too. you at the front. Okay. Yeah. What exactly is your profession? Just a technician. She's an engineer. Yeah. Oh, hey, I know another engineer in another horror game. They very well might get along. Yeah, but he gets a plasma cutter. He does. <laughs> but I get a flamethrower. But to be fair, <laughs> well, he gets a flamethrower later. Well. <laughs> Convenient, right? Yeah. Just that explosion. What happened? No, I think that's Ripley. No, 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 the the one that flew away. Oh, probably. Taylor, respond, anybody. I wonder if they died. Probably. Okay. I mean, really though. Like outright death? I mean, maybe. Well, they probably suffocate or crash land somewhere. I mean, but I don't even. Does she even look for them? She's in space. Yeah, but they could have gone that far. Yeah, they could have. There's no friction in space. I don't know. You like, get yeeted in space. You get yeeted hundreds of miles. I don't know, like. Like to catch up, she wouldn't just spacewalk. Yeah, but they could still like shoot around and whatnot on propulsion. They got they got miniature propulsion. That's not the point. Oh, is, and then to catch up, they she would have to start going faster than they are. All I'm saying is, like, I don't feel like she looked very hard for them. Once yeah, she, because like, they got yeeted at, like, 20 miles an hour. Oh, Brayden, all right, here's the thing, all right? If we were in space and you got heated and I, like, a, a couple like a, like a couple seconds later slammed into a space station and I was on the space station, you can bet I would have looked around for longer than, like, 10, 15 seconds for you. I promise you, I would have looked around for longer than that. Okay, I'll just have to take your word for it because I don't think I would look around longer for you. Oh wow, that's in a fair. spacewalk situation like that. That's very comforting. What, man? I have a fear of heights as well. D Even though there I'm are a no giant, heights in space. Uh, you can consider looking down at the planet heights. D you're not on a planet though. No, we're above one. Yeah, but we're not, orbiting a planet. You're probably not close enough to just get in there and get sucked in and die. Ugh. Oh, thank you. Thankfully, the power's working, right? Yeah, thankfully. Save point. Oh, there's, there's parts. Are you not gonna save? No. No? I don't think we're in any danger right now. Yeah, but still save the game. Oh uh, no, it takes a while. Yeah. It doesn't take that long. Yeah, but it takes time, which is the problem. It I takes can't just save like instantly. 
seven seconds, maybe. Yeah, but that's seven seconds where an alien could come right in. In the very beginning, I, I doubt that. Oh. <laughs> Brandon, it's, I think it's too early to worry about aliens. Yeah, it is, but that doesn't mean anything. It's still spooky. Do you want me to take control for no. a minute? That's not the point, okay? It's spooky, and that's all- that- that is good enough for me to have panic attacks, okay? I can understand being cared- uh, scared, but I can't- I literally can't do anything for Ooh, you- Oh, I can run now. If you're going to be cowardly. Well, I'm gonna be cowardly. Okay, well then I can't help you. I don't care. <laughs> Osha is gonna hear about this. Do you think Osha has any say over alien activity? It's not alien activity, it's a gas leak. Yeah, because of alien activity. No, because of people leaving the maintenance undone. Now, whether that was directly affected by alien activity, that's a different question. But what really matters is that they left that pipe valve open, and so now we have a flamethrower shooting fire in the hole. Scary, scary, scary. No, don't get us copyright striked. <laughs> you say that. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It's, it's like the camera, stick. maybe? Oh, it's the right stick to crouch. Fun. What does this one have to say? Corrupted folder. No. Oh. A lot of corrupted folders. Oh. So that's the is being decommissioned. What? Isn't this the station? Yeah, that's, it's where we're at. It's good. It's, it's being it's, decommissioned. How are they going to do that? Being, I don't know. It's a big place. It's basically a city. Yeah, it's a floating city. In the middle of space. So I'm gonna cut it up. Then there's health damage. Oh man, looks rough. Feels bad, guy. Probably does. God damn. Hey, Ooh, flare. flare. This will help. Maybe. Hold circle. Oh, okay, that's what that is. Right. What's your inventory? Are you gonna pop it though? Uh, no. Actually, I wasn't going to. Yeah. Ooh. You're counted as luggage? I like the feeling of the weather on my face. You know, I really shouldn't even be surprised. No, you really shouldn't. No. You always know working? Joe. He's got some, something against Joe, I guess. I don't. Someone new? 2137. Look, basically, what, it's what, like what, any what? horror game, all right? In the middle of a crisis, people are writing messages on walls. It happens all the time. Right, where they go insane. Well, that or they're just being thugs. Right. Is that a fetus? I, I doubt it's a fetus. <laughs> Why would you jump to that conclusion? I don't know, because it's funny. Like, how do you go straight? Him. How do you go straight to? Is it a fetus? Strangers will be shot, and no entry. No entry. Great. I'm pretty sure that's what that says. I'm pretty sure too. The white and the purple hmm. kind of make it hard to tell. Like bonding agent. Is there more shit down there? Uh, very. It's a very real possibility. I don't think so. Well, I guess you'll never know. I can go check. I'm gonna go check. Uh, okay. Bum 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 bum. See, you're in a much better mood seemingly than you were before. Really, because singing is my fear response. <laughs> so. <laughs> well, I said you seem like you're in a much better, much better mood. That doesn't mean that. Oh well, if it didn't hear you before, it hears you now. I don't care. Come eat my pussy. Oh, I bet he, I bet he will. Actually, he probably won't do that. That's hot. It's not. It's a literal oh alien. That's so if he's if he's doing that, he's probably doing it in the like the most literal sense possible. Like, Where he's like chomping it out. Well, yeah, like he's eating you. Yeah. Like like aliens do eat people, you know. I was about to say, like, why would you turn the radio off? 
There's smooth like... jazz. Can I just stay in here with my jazz music and never leave? No. But why? Well, because jazz music usually tends to attract a crowd. And here's the question. What kind of people are you going to attract into this crowd right now? I will say, this looks pretty freaking cool. Oh, it's very cool. It's a the shame kind of that... people who enjoy orgies. That's the answer to your question. Okay, well. <laughs> <laughs> Not a lot of those are going to, to be on the station that are... Well, if they are, they're... Probably a lot of them aren't even alive anymore, so... Forgotten? You are not forgotten. F you. No, F you, graffiti. You're literally bad mouthing a wall. Keep out. I'd rather not. No one. You are literally arguing with a wall. No one. This life for rent. Okay then. Open the menu. Not menu. Map. I have a map? Cool. If it wasn't for your prior experience, like play games, I don't actually. Oh. Nice. I don't actually know if I could trust you ah. to, to do anything useful. That's rude. In this I game. press square instead of X, like a ding dong. Great job. Well, you can always pick the flare up. I think. Yeah. Doesn't anything here work? Nope. Step on it. Burn your tootsies off. Yep, that. That is the answer. Oh. Oh, okay, it's a generator, I get it. Yeah. I don't know what it was, it was just interactable. It's a weird generator, though. Oh, it says right there, 2000 kgvs generator. I don't know what that term is for. It's probably kilojoules per vagina second, I don't know. I... Yes, <laughs> that sounds perfect. I can't a pos I can't possibly imagine what else that could be. And you know, sometimes you just you just really outdo yourself in you know it. I know, right? I just I just hear the thing the words you say and like the mysteries Door of the room. universe reveal themselves to Ooh. me. Okay. I'm gonna go look for that. Security checkpoint. Security checkpoint, yeah, thank you. Um now this looks kind of like a barricade. Chiga chuga chiga chuga chuga chuga. Uh, gate A. Employees only. Uh, there's 0340, I think. <laughs> How did you know that? I saw it in one of the things. Hey, another Pays player. Pays to pay attention, huh? Ding dong. Sure does. Sensors. Little oh, med kit. Blueprint. Sounds pretty useful. Oh, okay, okay. Um. Dragon. Well, now I have my flare again. Bum, 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 bum. Thing. Update map. Cool. Oh, okay. It's a map. It was a map. What? Restore power. The power is restored, you idiot. How do I restore more power? Ask your OSHA supervisor. Oh, did you see this thing? Freaking this what? uh these guys made the very first plasma-based proto lightsaber. Right, I think everybody's seen that by this point. Okay, I'm just making sure, because I thought it was sick as fuck. I wonder how effective it is. At, like, oh, cutting. you didn't watch the video? He actually cuts through a steel plate with it. Like, how long does it take him to do it? Uh, a little bit, because it's an actual, like, flame. But, yeah, you know, still pretty fucking sick, guy. It's very interesting. Am I just dumb? You know, yeah, you are. Shut up. Nobody asked for your opinion. You just asked. You I just... thought you weren't supposed to belittle others. That's different. <laughs> you asked that a different? question and I responded with the answer you so desired. I didn't desire that. You... Oh, didn't you now? No, I did not. Wow. I did not hit her. I did not. This <sighs> is bullshit. Oh, hi, Mark. 
Okay, there's like one other door I can think of. Where, where do I go? That's Freaking a very design? good question. Design. Find a way to restore power. Hold on, does that Go to the terminal. Yeah. Go to the terminal in there, it's obvious. I did. There's something. I've already been there. There's something in there that apparently you need. Why do you keep doing that? Dude, I just want to instinctively press square for Put things. the freaking flares away from now on. You no! Can't, you can't be trusted with them. You can't be trusted. You know what that means, Brendan? It means that you get to go through the dark places without light now. I'll just turn the brightness up. That's really, that's a really gay move. <laughs> you know what? You're gay. <gasps> Sir Power Would you departure. look at that? Oh, would you look at that? You're stupid. Store? There's a door right there, by the way. Yeah, I know. Do, do, do. Oh. Oh. Wait. Wait for me. Do not leave me here. Oh, you asshole. And for some reason, the door just can't be opened again. Get bent, idiot. I bet I don't have the right certification anymore. You know what I mean? No. Like, I don't have the... Like, I need special key cards or something. You know? I don't have the right clearance. There you go. No, it's because I just arrived on this ship and I am a foreigner. <laughs> Alright. I do not live here and I am not engineer staff. Yep, that's it. Oh right. no. Perfect. Keep going. What? <laughs> Yo, what do you I don't know? know what else I expected. It actually but hurts you. Also. <laughs> Like, as an engineer, you think you'd be smarter than that. Uh, what? Oh, okay, okay. Uh, where is what? A medkit. Oh, right. Uh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. It's a weird crafting system, but I got it. Is it now? Yeah. What Ooh, the big hell open area? happened here? Something really bad is gonna happen soon. No, something really bad has already. Yeah, someone's happened. gonna show up and shove its stuff inside of me. That's one way to put it. You might be slightly misleading the audience though with that that phrasing. I'm not misleading anybody. Anybody who's watching this video knows exactly what I'm talking about. Maybe. Oh, the wrong guy. This guy. I wanted to hold circle to run because I was playing Dark Souls last night. Hold square to activate. Activate what? Oh, my med kit's in my hand. Okay. Why do you keep taking items out? I have to hold square for this one. Well, do you want to use your med kit? You got like half health. No, I'll use it when I think I need it. Which obviously isn't now. Yeah. Look, I have played this beginning section before on your computer, but also. Spooky is spooky. Right. How long do you think you'll want to go? What's your appetite, man? Oh, that's the torrents. Very. I wonder if they're just leaving. I'm here. I'm right here. We're lame. They're looking for people. Totally not an alien trapped in here with you. There is not. I don't think so, anyways. God, I fucking hope not. I hate aliens. They need to get bent and throw themselves into space. That's racist. Yeah, it's earned. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Don't at me. <laughs> okay, everybody, at him. I can't get cancelled for saying alien stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Depends what kind of alien you're talking about. Xenomorphs. Okay. That sounds about right. Uh oh, what was that? It was a door opening. Are you sure? Yes. I'm pretty sure I saw some. Oh, oh. Oh, monsters. What are you doing, idiot? It's bobbing.
Why are you so fixated on that light? I can, I think I can interact with it. Does it have, dude, it has actual physics. I can bop my head on it. Bob, congratulations. How is that going to help you in your current prediction? I can give myself a concussion and then I don't think I'll be here anymore. Julia Jones, today's update. <laughs> After numerous demands, Marshal Waits finally called a public meeting to address the rumors that have been circulating on Sevastopol. But okay. instead of the answers we wanted, he continued to be evasive, and after only a few minutes, he and his team were pelted by projectiles from an angry crowd. A gun was fired, there was panic, and now Waits and what's left of his team are forcibly ejecting us from the terminal. Feels like we're on our own now. Alrighty then, well. So Apollo Publix. is the AI on the ship, and I feel like he's not going to be a good guy. Oh, and why is that? Uh, because I have seen Prometheus, oh, really? which takes place in the Alien universe. It, Spoilers, yeah. but the AI in that wanted to kill everybody. And like, usually in stories like this, like, uh, what's his name? Mal? Mal? I think his name is. He's the main AI on a ship in some horror movie. <laughs> Right. So. Well, you know where you gotta go. Take yeah. Take that bottle of ketchup with you. You might need it. Yes, for sure. All right. So I think I'm gonna end this one here. Alrighty. And so see you guys next time. You should go check out our group content because it's probably better than this. And you give us flack for being shillers. Yeah, but I only point them to our other shit. Uh huh. So it's right. fine. <laughs> right. Okay. All right. Well, bye-bye. All right, goodbye.